Um, so I'll try to get through this real quick, and then I'll show you the website. Microphone, please. Oh, okay. Uh, so Buckdate originally started uh, on March 30th, 2013 as a social networking website dedicated to helping people earn a living online. And that was kind of useful because it built up kind of a, a nice following it, just to show who was interested in finding ways to earn a living online. 717,000 members signed up uh, in 17 months. Um, so it relaunched August 1st, 2014, a little over a month ago, and uh, as a micro job website. Uh, this the big question, uh, how can I make money at bucket.com that everybody kept asking? And I didn't really have a good answer. I just did a bunch of research and found out that a fun and easy way members can earn a living online would be like this micro job platform. So uh, in its present form, it's this micro job platform and it asks the question is what services can you provide to people and how much would you charge for those services? And a good example is I will make you a website for 500 bucks, something like that. Um, why did I start it? My three passions, I have a background in financial and social services, uh, website development and social networking. And uh, mm -hmm. so I kind of combined those passions together. I think a lot of ideas sort of come from that kind of a concept. Competitors, Amazon, eBay, Etsy, Fiverr. And um, you know, it's hard to start a store at Amazon, eBay, Etsy. Fiverr kind of implies $5 jobs. So this kind of eliminates the negative parts of those two things combined into one interface. Uh, the strengths, it seems like it's a lot of interest, 718,000 members. Uh, there's a uh, strong potential for people to actually find a way to earn a living online with this newest iteration. And uh, there aren't that many identical competitors, specifically identical. Um, so getting started, and I'll show this, uh, you join, you post a job, you share it with all your friends and followers on your social networks. And hopefully it goes viral or something, you know. Um, and this is step one, join, post jobs, share your jobs, and I'll, I'll try to show that if I have enough time. Uh, the future, when I say connect with old friends, you most likely immediately think Facebook. When I say online, you most likely immediately think Amazon. At some point, I'd like people to say earn a living online, people to automatically think Bucket, you know. Um, and I hope someday that Bucket will be a repository of all ways that people can earn a living online, not just this micro-jobbing platform that it's in in its present form. So how do I do that again? I go, uh, command and tab. I'm also a PC person. Okay, so this is what the website looks like right now. Pretty self-explanatory. I will blank for blank dollars. Uh, you know, uh, if you click on like I will and you like you want to do something, it'll automatically ask you to register. Just like registering with anything else, username, password, verify, stuff like that. Um, but I'll try to log in real quick. Uh -oh. What happened? I went back instead of... Uh, this is what happens, right, with the live demos? <laughs> Never do a live demo. Never do a live demo, yeah. <laughs> Always do slides. Uh, you want to speak to some of the points? Um, I mean, I, you got a chance to take a glimpse at it while it's trying to pull back up, I guess. It, it seems pretty self-explanatory, right? You, I will blank for blank dollars. Probably everybody in here has something they will do for some amount of money. It sort of appeals to the kind of the lowest common denominator of ways to earn a living online uh, through the research that I've done. And uh, Eric Skaggs, and nobody look, hmm. right? Okay, let me see if I can do it real quick. Oh, all right. What's that mean? Is that my fault? Okay. All right, anyways, you can, get, you can see some of the goofy examples. I mean, it's meant to be fun, you know. Uh, I'll give you, I don't know, that's, you can't talk about that, right? Um, a friend of mine makes uh, purses out of ties. She'll make you one for 70 bucks if you give her your old ties. You know, stuff like that. I think anybody can kind of understand an example like that. You can filter them by different uh, methodologies. They're categorized. And then on the other end, what are you looking for? You can suggestions down here. I'm looking for someone who will blank. So uh, uh, I guess I'm offline, but I guess that's so much for the demo, right? Uh, 30 seconds. I don't know what else to say. Hi, everybody. <laughs> uh, go to bucket.com, join, check it out. See if you can, uh, maybe I'll post a job with our selfie on it. I don't know.
Uh, I guess this kind of shows where my mind goes, but uh, let's say Ken wanted to get rid of his business partner uh, and uh, said, you know, I'll do X for Y. How, how do you, can you filter out uh, illegal uh, activities uh, on here? Administratively, I have complete control. So if somebody posts something that I find to be like not in line with something that's all age appropriate or that's like not nice or something like that, I could take it down. I guess I would take requests if anybody ever suggested I take you, it down. But you would have to physically look at each and every post. Yeah. yeah. Of your 700. And it's just me, so it's kind of tough. Stuff slips by, you know, but I try not to let it. So out of the uh, 717,000 people, um, and, and you made a pivot, so yeah. um, how, how many of those are actually posting and you know, actually fulfilling jobs. Right. Um, well, since I did this pivot like a little over a month ago, um, a thousand new people have signed up. I, at this point, and since I'm trying to do this on a dime, don't really have the monetary capability of, uh, I don't have like an SMTP server that can handle sending out 717,000. I haven't even told the initial sign up people that this new iteration exists. So I'm just depending on this as a standalone and then I have that as a newsletter thing I could send out later once I get the capacity to send out that many emails. You know, right. if anybody knows how to do that, let me know. For free, I wanna do it for free. <laughs> so not, I haven't really let them know. It's weird, right? I don't know, what are you gonna do? Do you have any last comments? Um, have, have you looked into like Time Bank? Or heard of it? It's a, it's a similar type model where you donate your time and you can share. Like, if I spend two hours mowing your lawn, will you spend two hours helping me with my math homework? Oh, that's kind neat. So yeah. Like Trading people, services. Yeah. So it's based on time, um, based on people's comparative advantage of expertise. And okay. And that's actually another similar um, model of trading that you yeah. might like to look at in terms of just a, a reference source. I'll look into that. I'm always looking to integrate new ideas into this. I'm hoping at some point it won't just be this. It'll be always. You know, and that, that sounds like a good way. I'll look into it. Okay. Well, thank you.